Good evening, gamers. Today we're going to learn how to install Thug2 on PC and install a mod for it called Clown Job. It was made by a guy named White Hot Agony, aka Gone. A legit copy of Thug2 will not run on most people's PCs without this mod, but it also comes with more features like higher resolution, orderless windowed, widescreen, PS2 controls, and more. It's a lot easier to find a copy of Thug2 PC since it came out in North America the same week as it did for PS2, GameCube, and Xbox, whereas Thug1 was only released in Australia like six months after its release for consoles. If you watch my how to install Thug1 on PC, the install process is very similar. The first step is you gotta get a copy of Thug2 PC on eBay or on Amazon or your friend down the street or sail across the seas to your friend's house to borrow it and take it home back across the sea. Let's get Thug2 installed. Streamer installs game from 2004 in 2024. <laughs> Do I want to install Games by Arcade? No, I'll do it later. Install DirectX now. If you don't have 9.0 C or higher, the game will not run properly. Are you sure you don't want to do it? I'm sure. And then we're going to search Thug2 Clown Job. And it should be the first result on THPSX forums right here. So we're going to click this. So we're just going to grab version 1.2. So we got Clown Job just downloaded right here. So we're going to double click. Click this, hit extract to. I'm going to create a new folder on our desktop called, yeah, let's just call it Thug2 Clown Job. And hit OK. Close that. Here's our Thug2 Clown Job. The folder that I need to be in does not exist. I think it's because I haven't opened the game yet successfully. So I'm just going to try and do Tony Hawk's Underground 2 game. So I'm gonna grab the I and I, click and drag it over, open it up. Borderless Windows 1, Windows 0, 2560 by 1440. PS2 controls 1, button font styles. I'm using PS3 controllers, so we're gonna use the PS2 ones. So I'm gonna hit 1 right here, and I think that's it. Add Clown Job DLL and Thug2 EXE to Tony Hawk's Underground 2 slash game directory. DLL. And thug two, so I'm gonna click and drag this over and continue, continue. Thug two exe is screaming. <laughs> okay, so why don't we take a stab at like just opening Thug two? Surely it's gonna go great. I I anticipate since we're playing with the PS three controller, that's like not an X input device that we're gonna run into the same problem as like our L two is gonna share the same button as R two. So here's the launcher. Let's go to gamepad binding. I have my PS3 controller plugged in, so I'm gonna hit that. And I'm just gonna forward, backward, left, right, camera up, down, left, right, ollie, grab, flip, grind, pause. Ooh, is this R3 or select? Let's try R3. Get off board. Ooh, I don't know which one this is. I think it's L1, R1, L2, R2. L3. Park editor would be D pad, I think so. Up, down, left, right. Hit save settings and quit. So let's go back to where's our game folder? Let's try and run this thing. Thug two. Oh my god, it worked. Look, we literally could not run the game. Ah! We could not run the game um without the mod. But when once we install the mod, we're stoked. And that's it. Make sure you like, comment, describe, click all those links below. Stick around for the Thug 2 100% playthrough that we just did. It's gonna be a beefer. Babe, wake up. New sleep aid just dropped. It's gonna be bussin' content, brother. By the time this is out and you're watching it, maybe the video will be recommended right here. And I'll give you time to click it now. Do it. Okay, bye.